Hello everyone and welcome back to this rather impromptu video. So, if you guys saw my last video, I covered a new AI called Simulacrobot that is powered by a text-to-image generator known as Stable Diffusion. Now, this new text-to-image AI, Stable Diffusion, will be entirely open source and is created by Stability AI, and they have a beta sign-up which is right here. I will link this down in the description below if you guys want to sign up to get a chance at accessing this new text to image generator. Of course, eventually it's going to be public, completely open source for anyone to use and mess with, and plenty of very good AIs will come out of it. But if you want to join the beta access, then, then feel free to sign up with the link in the description. So they're going to be releasing this public stable diffusion model next Friday. So this is 8-5-2022. So that's not so far off at all. And again, that's for people who have signed up for the beta of Stable Diffusion. And early this upcoming week, they're going to start sending out invites, which is super exciting. So apparently there's going to be a web page and a Discord server that they are making for Stable Diffusion. And it's running on the 10th largest supercomputer in the world, which is fascinating. And if you're wondering where I got all this information, I got it from a Stable Diffusion Discord server, which is somewhat official. There are people who work for Stable Diffusion in this server. Server, but it's not necessarily created by the company. However, it's going to be full of actually official news for sure and tons of information regarding it. And if you don't have access to Stable Diffusion, whether you're watching this next week when Stable Diffusion is starting to go out to public users, in this server you'll actually be able to submit prompt suggestions to be generated. So I will also provide a link to this Discord down in the description below. And as you can see, the sneak peek of Stable Diffusion is absolutely fantastic. You can generate images of famous people. And when the open source version of Stable Diffusion releases, there will basically be no restrictions because it's open source software. So whatever developer developer can modify it in whatever way they want. Apparently there also will be the ability to do variations as well with Stable Diffusion, so that's very interesting and very exciting. Not many text to image AIs can do variations. I actually only know of Dolly 2 that can do this, so having another AI that can do this is very exciting. But yeah, you could definitely generate stuff that's not normally allowed in Dolly 2. This is a raccoon smoking a cigarette, and I mean obviously you can't generate famous people in Dolly 2. Like this is Danny DeVito as a Grand Theft Auto 5 cover art. But yeah, as you can see, Stable Diffusion is actually capable of quite a lot and competes with Dolly 2, like I showed in my last video, which again, you guys can check out with the link in the description. So I think this is really going to shake up the AI game in general. Some other notes are Stable Diffusion is a suite of image creation models. It's not going to be just one. The beta isn't a consumer product. It's only there to test new and upcoming models. And these models will find their way into all of your favorite collabs and products. They say that they are creating a model that is as good as Dolly 2, and the current version of Stable Diffusion, which is 800 million parameters, fits on 5 gigabytes of VRAM, so it'll run on actually a decent amount of graphics cards. So if your PC is beefy enough, you will actually be able to run Stable Diffusion text -to image generation on your own computer, so you're not going to have to pay for anything if you can run it at home. Not to say that Stable Diffusion won't be open source, which means that anyone can create a site with it and run it with ads for free, so it could be free either way eventually. So Stable Diffusion is capable of creating images with nudity, although Discord prohibits this, so obviously it's it's not allowed in Discord at least. In and out painting are in the works currently, similar to what Dolly 2 does where you can in paint and have the AI fill in parts of your image. And of course, we already talked about it, variations are coming. Long term, the bot is going to be replaced with a website similar to Midjourney in that regard at least, but it's going to start on Discord. But again, guys, this beta is not a commercial service that we talked about in the beginning of the video. It's a little test community for all of the new models. And you are strongly encouraged to sign up for the beta because it is going to have tons of upcoming cutting edge AI stuff. I've already signed up. I do have access to stable diffusion like you saw in my last video, but when I do get access to the rest of this stuff through the normal application process, you bet I am going to be making some amazing videos on it. So yeah, at the moment, if you're watching this video the day it's uploaded, Beta invites have not been sent out yet, and again, the current users are handpicked for being well-known people in the field. I was lucky enough to be one of these handpicked users, simply by talking to one of the people who was involved with the project. And also, what's really exciting is a larger, more powerful model, nicknamed V2, is aimed to fit 16 gigabytes of VRAM, so that's a much larger graphics card than... 5 gigabytes, but technically you could run it at home with a good enough graphics card. But the 5 gigabyte one's already very, very powerful, I have to say. Anyways, yeah, I strongly encourage you guys to join the Discord. This is cutting edge AI stuff, and that's why I wanted to share it with you guys today. 
But yeah, in general, guys, there's so much really cool stuff already being generated. So Stable Diffusion, at least, I think is going to really shake up the AI game. And to me, at least, this news was just something I had to share with you guys, even though this video is a little impromptu. So yes, everybody, thank you for watching. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Are you excited for another AI to hit the scene? I certainly am. All links are in the description. Check out my other videos, and I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.